Kampala Capital City Authority law enforcers in company of police officers stormed the streets of Kampala with the intention of evicting street vendors and hawkers. Well, wait, who is the owner of this car? This car means... The KCCA officers were enforcing the cabinet resolution to have the city's streets cleared of traders, which was passed last week. Many of the street vendors had their merchandise confiscated and those who resisted were arrested. <laughs> Sulaiman Chisitu, a former Wero Bush war fighter, has been earning a living as a street vendor on Namirembe Road, having lost a leg during the war. He claims that he has been haunted by the evictions ever since they started. Today, Chisitu refused to leave the streets, saying that his condition doesn't allow him to do any other work. The street vendors claim that they have tried and successfully to dialogue with city authorities. However, some city dwellers have welcomed the move. Anyway, the chiba de chibi kesi so kujoku ba jau kwa ngemoto kwa ziko la jia moroko le ramu kubo. Olaba, masigiri mchibuga wakati. Inyama micheo mowuli chimucho na ajo mzibo mowuli utinefuga. According to the Kampala Lord Mayor Arias Lukwago, the law doesn't permit KCCA to evict the vendors. It compels KCCA, it's an obligation mandate of KCCA to prepare licenses for each and every category provided for in the law. For those who operate in the shops, within the premises, those who sit by the roadside or on the veranda or the, wherever they can be, they are all traders who are recognized under the law and they are supposed to be licensed. Those who do hawking, who move from one place to another, they, are, they also have their type of license which should also be provided for by KCCA. And those who operate from within markets. I have been um, carrying on with uh a lot of communication to members of the public and uh, reaffirming the position that uh, hawking and vending in the city remains illegal. However, KCCA says different markets have been opened up for the vendors but they have refused to utilize them. Then uh, also bought Wusafi, uh, which has over 2,000 spaces for people to, to vend. <laughs> If you ask KCCA here if there is even a single market which is gazetted, there, there isn't any. In 2015, KCCA introduced a Sunday market where Luwum Street is closed to traffic and vendors are allowed to sell their merchandise. However, the vendors and politicians say that just one day is not enough for them to make ends meet. Solomon Kawesa, NTV.